Want to know the real way to stay on track? The real secret? Find someone who will not let you quit. Today, we're talking accountability. Okay, welcome to today's episode of One Take, your daily book kicking, your daily dose of motivation from myself, Connor Anderton. If you are new here and you don't know who I am, of course, I'm Connor Anderton. I'm an online coach of the last decade, working with guys who want to transform their physique and get incredibly strong in the process. So, Today's episode, I'm out of breath after saying that, I do apologise, is we're talking accountability, the secret to staying on track. Should we be lone wolves? Should we find a training partner? Should we work with a coach? Do we ask our wife, our husband, whatever it might be, to help us out to join the journey? Let's be honest, guys. No matter what you do in life, you're always going to move forward, get further ahead, if you've got somebody on your side. There is no such thing as a self-made man or a self-made woman, self-made whatever. Um, this really resonated me with me, should I say, when I watched the <coughs> Arnold Schwarzenegger documentary on Netflix titled Arnold. <coughs> Apologies, my voice is going a little bit. He talks about on the documentary how he isn't self-made. And you look at the upcome come up of Arnold and you would think he was self-made you know like extremely hard working willing to put himself in situations willing to travel willing to ride his bike two hours to the gym and two hours back in the freezing cold you know in Austria in the winter so you would claim oh he's done all that himself yes absolutely however from the from the man himself he claims he was not self-made and there's always people willing to help you willing to give you their experience willing to point you in the right direction, hold you accountable, um, you know, d- do what they can in order to help you, you know, progress. So if you think about any sort of situation, even with uh, situations with work, let's say you get an interview, somebody might have told you about this job, um, somebody might have helped get you experience in this job, you know, you might have had a mentor, you might have had a friend or something, Um there's a million different ways, right? And when it comes to your training, this is this is vital now. If you train with a training partner, I guarantee you will move forward quicker. This is somebody who has been training for the last 16 years. I've been training, I believe, 16, 17 years. I've trained on my own. I've had multiple training partners. Let me tell you, training with someone in the gym, you go further. You lift an extra rep. You go an extra few kilos. From a safety factor... You just are a confidence factor. You can rely and trust that person in order to help you when you're there or if you're feeling a little lower that day, lacking the energy, that person can give you a slap on the back and say, nah, come on, step it up. Do your set, work a little bit harder. And that's all that it takes. Accountability is a huge factor in any form of success in life, especially with your training. So if you are somebody who trains on their own and you're struggling, Maybe it is time to find a training partner. Maybe it is time to get a bit of an accountability from a coach who, you know, will help hold your hand a little bit, in all honesty. I'm not saying that it's an absolute requirement because it is not. If you are training on your own currently and you are progressing, you're progressing. What I'm saying is, is that you'll probably progress a little bit more with someone by your side, okay? It's just a, it's just a fact of life. Let's be honest. So... Picture this, you are really tired after work and you sit on the couch and you go, oh, that's really comfy and the TV's on and you've got a cup of tea. Sorry for the people listening in the US, but you've got a cup of tea and you're really comfortable and you just think, oh, just melt into that couch. You think, oh man, I've got to go to the gym. Tell you what, it's been a hard day, it's been a long day, I've worked hard. I'm just going to take a rest day today. I, I deserve it. No, picture this. <laughs> it's a long day at work. You sit on the couch. You make a cup of tea. You dig dead comfy on the gym. And you get a message through on your phone that says, still up for the gym in an hour? Can't wait. I'm going to hit 
this bench press. I'm going to hit this squat today. Let's go. I'm buzzing. This is the, the, the main thing I've been excited for all day. And you go, oh, man, I'm going to have to go to the gym. I'm going to have to get my butt up, get changed, get my mentality ready, switch on and get to the gym. You see where I'm going with it? It's more obvious that you're going to progress with your training partner. Or even if you work with a coach. I heard a comment today from a client of mine who was talking about working with me, who had been recommending me to a friend of his. And he said, it's the accountability that matters. And I replied to him. I said, a lot of the time working with a coach, it's not even the, the knowledge that you're paying for. The knowledge is there, of course it is. But it is the accountability. It's that person that you have to answer to. It's that person who's going to review your week. And from a client point of view, and I know this from hiring coaches and working with many coaches in the past, you don't want to let your coach down. I mean, you don't want to let yourself down, but trust me, you don't want to let your coach down. You don't want to get to that weekly check-in, him open it up and go, Christ, this client's a pain in the ass. And once again, they've not done what they, what they said they're going to do. You don't want that as a client. You want to show up, smash it, your coach open up your check-in and go, proud of this guy. There's a reason this guy is getting the result that he came to me for. Okay, and that is purely from accountability. So whether you invest into a coach, which is always worth the money, or you work with a training partner, you know, it's always going to benefit you. So if you are somebody who is struggling currently with motivation, maybe look into one or the other, or maybe both, I don't know. And I guarantee you just get your spark for training back. And I think that's really important because we're not perfect. We're only human. We can't be motivated, inspired, 365 days of the year that's just not going to happen we can't be motivated 24 hours of the day there's going to be down periods <clears throat> whether we're stressing more whether we're under the weather you know it just it is what it is we've got any i don't know got an injury coming back i don't know but what a training partner will help with is is that consistency of that showing up when you know you don't want to, but you have to and you should do and you need to in order to get the result that you have been aiming for. So keep that in mind. And the next time you set the coach, your cup of tea, you're comfy after work, think, <clears throat> what would happen if I had to stay accountable to a coach or a training partner? I'd be getting my ass right up off this coach and getting myself ready and going working on myself and working on my goals. Which, again, if you listen to my previous podcast from the week, we know that working on your goals is the only way to feel good about yourself. Every time you let yourself down, it's that little spiral in your mental health of where you feel a little bit worse about yourself and you start to just have a worse life. It sounds really dramatic, but as someone who has not held himself accountable and as somebody who holds himself to a very high standard now and the majority of the time, trust me, I'm a lot happier. My mental state is in a lot better place when i'm on it let's put it that way and i know my clients are too so if you are struggling find some help get some motivation get inspired get accountable and move forward but guys that's it for today's podcast i hope it helped i hope you took some ideas and some motivation away from this if you liked it please click like maybe leave a comment and subscribe to the channel it really helps out i would appreciate that but for now i'll see you in tomorrow's episode